Hello everybody, welcome back to Golden Dragon Games. I'm your host, Rocky2815. And today we are doing a Pokemon Alpha Sapphire video. Sorry if you heard any weird noises there, but um, I would just try to adjust my microphone stand because the green light on my microphone keeps flashing red, which means I'm possibly talking too loud. Wait, it's... Ugh. Never mind, we'll just have to go with it and see if there's any voice, you know, sound issues in editing, I'll try and fix them. But anyway, this is a one-shot take thing anyway, because we are doing a mystery gift. Today we are doing the mystery gift of Hooper. If you are in the UK slash Europe, you will be able to pick up a code on a receipt from your local game. If you're in North America or any other part of the US, I believe you have to go to a McDonald's to get it. Now I'm not sure how long this special event Pokemon is on for, so do go get it as soon as you can. So communications must be open, get with a code. If your battery is running blah, blah, blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. We know all of this. Let's just connect to the internet and continue because I've got the code right here in my hand apart from you can't see it because I have no face cam because face when I tried to bring back face cam for a Minecraft video it was sort of a complete failure. But anyway, let's type in the code and also if you think you can just simply enter the same code I did to get the Hooper, you will not be able to because each code is unique. So, um, Excuse me if I'm absolutely silent, but um, it's a bit hard to talk at the same time while typing the code. Okay, let's type it in and see if it works. Right. Hopefully I typed it in right because I can quite often type stuff in wrong when I'm reading off of something. Yes! Wow! It's a Hooper! Receive this mystery gift, yes or no? Of course, yes. But let's read the description that you can probably see on the bottom screen, mind you, from recording point of view, the bomb screen actually looks a bit off. I'm pretty sure I'm recording 30 FPS or 60, but anyway. The mythical Pokemon Hooper is here. This Hooper knows the move Hyperspace Hole, a new and powerful move that only Hooper can learn. Receive mystery gift, yes, connecting to the internet, so we'll just have to wait for a minute. My throat sounds a bit sore. Um, I've been doing a whole bunch of batch recordings. I've literally filmed six other videos before this. Oh, Hooper! Please pick up your gift from the delivery girl in any Pokemon Center. Thank you for playing Pokemon. Please pick up your gift from the delivery girl at the Pokemon Center. A button done. Quick. Right, let's go in game and see about this Hooper, but also there is a special thing that happens if you talk to a certain person at the Pokemart with Hooper in your party. And sorry this is an actual episode, 
but I should have one up later this week. Today is Thursday, so either f I'm gonna say Saturday or Sunday because I I've been doing a bunch of batch recording, but so I already got a software anyway. I think I'm going to be losing my voice by this evening. But anyway, <clears throat> good day. You must be rocking. Wow, that 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 that's a really weird voice. But let's all just roll with it. <clears throat> I got a mystery gift here with your name on it. Here you are! Rocky received Hooper! We look forward to serving you again. Let's have a look at Hooper's stats. Level 50, nice. Summon. So, Hooper knows Hyperspace Hole, which is Psychic, PP 5 out of 5. Psychic which is a psychic move, 10 PP. I just... <sighs> Sorry about that notification. I should have returned my iPad off before. Who looks really weird for some odd reason in the bottom screen on my computer recorder. I'll just stop here recording for a minute and just check. Okay, just check back on the little last bit of the recording. Something definitely is wrong with the bomb screen so I'm gonna have to uninstall and reinstall my 3DS viewing software obviously but for now um I really need to do this video plus as we already typed in the code I can't go back and re-record it unfortunately so and I've just skipped on to different Pokemon so anyway like I was saying Astro Something, ghost type move, P, P, 15, last move, nasty, plot, dark move, 20, P, P, level 50, obviously, I think this is a cherry ball it's in, it's got some item called a focus sash, um, the Pokemon steals the held item of a Pokemon it hits with a move, ID number, uh, own a Harry, dex number, unknown, attack, 124, defense, 88, special attack, 170, special defense, 135, speed, 90, HP, 154, and let's see if we can see its nature. Uh, nature is lax. But let's do something else while we're here. Now it's there. Yeah, there's a shop over here. Just need to check. Hang on just a minute, that's my telephone. Okay, everybody, I'm back and I have fixed the problem. Turns out I didn't put it on full 60 FPS like I should have. It was limited to 30 and that was what was causing the bomb screen to go funny. So I'm just going to let everybody have another quick little look at Hooper's stats and also the actual picture of Hooper in the bottom screen and also his move. So... Just, you know, I'll give you a couple of minutes or seconds. Okay. And this part, I did not read. This is um, all about the beauty contest sort of stuff. So, hyperspace hole, clever. Psychic, clever. Whatever this third move's called, cute. Nasty plot, clever. Hmm. Okay. And it lacks nature, but the top screen was fine when you saw this. It was just a bottom screen where you saw Hooper. It was all funny. But anyway, why are we in a Pokemon Mart? Because of this guy. <laughs> hey, do you have a minute for a story? 
This is something that happened when I was watching the store one time. Ooh, watching the store. It was like a totally dark night. Moonless! No moon! My lord! The werewolves must have been angry. And I was all alone. No way, this is so creepy. Then suddenly, whoosh! Out of nowhere, the automatic sliding doors slides open. Of course it does, it was probably a customer. And then this super duper creepy old guy comes in kinda und something, you know, kinda shambling. I think that says understeady. The what uh, the, the word I can read. So I think how terrible and scary is this? And then the old guy shuffles over to me. He has a package like clutched in his hands. He's mumbling that he has to show it to me. Then he asks, "Do you know what this is worth?" He keeps starting right. He keeps staring right at me and not even blinking. I was so freaked out I would be too. I was like, "Oh yes, it's a uh, really something, isn't it?" So the old guy grins at me and he says, Then I will give you this instead of money. Now give me everything you've got in this store. That's what he said really. I was like, what is this too weird, my dude? But uh, I was so... I was scared so I started shoveling over potions and like whatever I could reach. I gave the dude everything for his stupid package and out he goes like with a wicked grin on his face. As he walks out he says, three days. For a mere three days will Hooper be unbound. Really? I was all, stop freaking me out! With this nonsense, I was like sweating. Uh, TMI, which, uh, in case you people who don't know out there, means too much information. We do not need to know about his sweat, I don't think. Plus, this is a family friendly channel. The back of my shirt was soaked. Oh, that is gross. Anyway, nothing I could do, so I opened the package. It's just a dirty old bottle, like, really? So I go, weirdness, wondering what's in it. I grabbed the stopper and carefully pulled it loose. Blacked. It popped open, but there was nothing inside of it, so I figured I was... I totally got fooled. Thank you for listening to my story. You know what? I'm going to give you the bottle from that night because you're really so nice. It's not doing me any good anyway, really. Rocky obtained the prison ball. Sometimes I wonder if it really is only a dirty old bottle. Those last words that old guy said as he left for a mere three days will Hooper be unbound and there goes the phone again so okay sorry about that that was my dad calling yet again um about something I can't about if I want anything from the shops but I said no um and I told him I was recording, so... Yeah. If you want to blame anybody for those two interruptive phone calls that you might or might not have heard in the video, uh, hashtag blame my dad. Ow. I just hit my desk. <laughs> anyway, uh, for me, three days will Hooper be unbound. Just can't seem to get that out of my head. So... What the words mean is, if we give Hooper 
prison bottle, he will change into his unbound form for free in-game slash real life days. Potion, no, key items. A bottle believed to have been used to seal away the powers of a certain Pokemon long, long ago. And there he goes, Hooper's changed forms. Let's have a look at this beast. Okay, his moves stay the same, his body has obviously changed. His stats have slightly changed, attack 174, defense 88, special attack 190, special defense 135, speed 100. I'm not sure if, uh, ow, I just hit my knee again on the desk, trying not to scream in pain. But anyway, so yes, that is Hooper Unbound. Still the same nature. So, yeah. I'm going to leave the video off here for today. Like I said, a proper episode of the third episode of the LP. Because I do want to get this LP done by sort of early beginning of next year. Because I will be doing a Pokemon X playthrough. So, thank you everybody for watching. Remember to leave a like, favorite, share, comment, subscribe, but also remember to check out the French Mudkips, who is the person who did this brilliant Pokemon Alpha Sapphire layout I'm using. He also does other Pokemon layouts, so please go and check his channel and Twitter out. Links will be in the description to him. Remember to follow him on Twitter and subscribe to him and watch his videos until him I sent you. Okay. Until next time, everybody, stay golden, stay frosty, and bye, Zeese.